Evans here for Video Language Network, the unique website for authentic English video lessons. Here at Video Language Network, we believe that improving your English begins by watching and listening to English as it is spoken in the real world. Today, we're going to watch and listen to part of an interview with Chris Boykos, art historian, professor, and owner of an art gallery in Paris. In the following segment, I ask Chris about his favorite painters, and he's ready with an answer. Before watching the interview, let's look at an expression that Chris uses when he tells us that his favorite painter is Manet. This expression, which is used a lot in English, is without any doubt. We use this expression without any doubt to emphasize or demonstrate a strong opinion. When we say without any doubt, we are saying that there is no question. For example, she is without any doubt the best student I have ever taught. Watch this segment and remember, you don't have to understand every word. Just try to understand the basic meaning the rest will follow. I'll be back right after with more of your lesson of the day. Here we go. And is there a particular artist that you like more than any other? In that period, I think one of the greatest is uh, Edward Manet, without any doubt, because uh, he paints people. Um, apart from uh, you know the impressionist concerns of light uh, and landscape, and uh, I think he did some of the most beautiful and in some sense I would say even light-hearted portraits a great deal of sympathy for the people he paints uh, and at the same time a great deal of psychological penetration. Hi, Anita Evans back again. Did you hear Chris use the expression without any doubt? It is often helpful to hear these expressions in the context of a conversation so we know how to use them. Let's look at some more vocabulary used by Chris in the interview. Chris says that Manet paints beautiful and light-hearted portraits. Let's look at this adjective, light-hearted. To be light-hearted means to be literally light of heart or free from care, cheerful and without worry. Chris also says that Manet's portraits have a great deal of psychological penetration. One can guess at this meaning. Let's break it down. Psychology is the scientific study of the way the human mind works and how it influences behavior. The word penetration in this sense means to understand quickly and completely. So put together, Psychological penetration means to deeply understand the inner mind. In his paintings, Manet shows a deep understanding of the inner minds of his subjects. We hope you have enjoyed today's lesson from Video Language Network. For more lessons like the one you just viewed, join us at our website, www videolanguagenetwork.com. At our website, you can download more video lessons, plus you can download transcripts, vocabulary aids, and exercises that will help you improve your English language skills. That's all for now. Look for us next time on your local podcast sites. This is Anita Evans for Video Language Network. Bye-bye.